Logging into a computer is as easy as typing a password, if any, and tapping the sign in button. If your PC refuses to load your profile, and there's a blue screen with a user profile cannot be loaded, error message on it. Then there's a problem with some files or services that powers your PC's user profile. Follow any of the two solutions in this video to fix this error. This error usually occurs after a Windows 10 update, or when you create a new user profile. Some users have also reported this error after completing a system restore. Whatever the case might be, we have listed two ways to fix it in this tutorial. One of the most cited causes of the user profile cannot be loaded error on Windows 10 is a corrupt or damaged ntuser.dat file. To fix this, you can replace the ntuser.dat file in the default profile of your computer with an uncorrupted ntuser.dat file. Here's how to go about it. On the sign in page, hold the shift button and tap restart. That will launch the Windows 10 boot options menu through which you'd be able to boot your computer into safe mode. Tap Troubleshoot. Tap Advanced Options. Click Startup Settings. Tap Restart. Tap F4 or the number 4 on your keyboard to boot your PC into safe mode. Launch the file explorer and open the local disk C folder. Double click users to open the folder. The default profile folder is, by default, always hidden on a Windows PC. Tap the hidden items box to check it. That will make the default profile folder as well as other hidden files visible in your file explorer. Double tap default. Locate the ntuser.dat file and rename it. Alternatively, you can move it to another folder on your computer or an external storage device, say a USB flash. Now, return to the Users folder, C. Users and copy the ntuser.dat file of your guest profile or any other profile that works to the default user folder. Double tap the guest profile folder or whatever your computer's guest folder is named. Copy the ntuser.dat file from the guest profile folder and paste it in the default profile folder. Now try to log back into the profile that was displaying the user profile cannot be loaded error and you should be able to log in successfully. If method number one above doesn't work, changing and ensuring the startup type of your user profile service is set to automatic should help. To do that, you would have to access the Windows Services Manager. But since you cannot log in to your computer, you would have to again boot your PC into safe mode to access the Windows Service Manager like I showed in first method. On the sign in page, hold the shift button and tap restart. That will launch the Windows 10 boot options menu through which you'd be able to boot your computer into safe mode. Tap Troubleshoot. Tap Advanced Options. Click Startup Settings. Tap Restart. 
Tap F4 or the number 4 on your keyboard to boot your PC into safe mode. Tap the Windows key plus R shortcut to launch the run command. Type or paste services.msc into the box and tap OK. Locate user profile service and double click on it to reveal its properties. Under the startup type section, ensure it is set to automatic. Tap OK now restart your computer to see if you are able to log in successfully.